Glory to Jesus Christ. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Hello, brothers. Hello, sisters in Christ. I hope that you all are fantastic in the Lord. I hope that you all are well and blessed in the Lord. Hallelujah. People of God, this is going to be a short yet powerful word. This is a prophetic word. The Lord commanded me to come on here and deliver this message. I hope that you all will take heed to what the Lord is saying right now. God is saying that it is time to put down the stuff that keeps you busy. It is time to put those things away that have been occupying your time, okay? God is calling the body of Christ to the throne room. God says that as we are entering into Pentecost, God wants to speak to you about those things that you've prayed about. God wants to um, address the petitions that you've made into the courts of heaven. God wants to answer those prayers. God wants to give you his secrets. The Lord showed me John 15, 15 this morning, people of God. And I'm going to paraphrase what that scripture says. It says that the Lord no longer calls you his servant. Why? Because when you are a servant, you don't know your master's business. But in the, in the text, it, it goes on to say that God has now called you his friend. God now considers you to be his friend. And so he wants to give you the secrets. He wants to talk to you. He wants to teach you. He wants to show you the things that God, his father has shown him. He wants to reveal those things to you. And so God is inviting you, child of God, to come into the throne room. God is saying that this is an urgent call to the throne room. God is saying that if you're looking to get those things addressed, if you're looking for the answers, if you're looking for um, a revelation, if you're looking for the secret, if you're looking for the thing that you haven't seen, God is saying that now is the time to come to the throne room. Now is the time to drop at his feet. People of God, I hear the Lord saying that many of you are going to be called into a fast an immediate fast an unexpected fast. How do I know that? Because today, I had no plans, but I just heard God say, I don't care how hungry you are. I don't care how famished you are. I don't care how you feel malnourished. I need you to fast. I need you to come into the secret place with me because I have something that I need to speak to you about. People of God, this is a word from the throne. God is calling you to the throne. He's calling all of his children, all of his beloved to the throne. He is making a call to you because God is saying that he has some things that he wants to reveal to you. And if you are in tune with the Holy Spirit, God is saying that he will speak to you specifically and personally about that situation, about that circumstance that you have been praying about, about, about the circumstance that he had been speaking to you about. Now is the time to get your plan. Now is the time to get your strategy. Now is the time to hear God more clearly. Now is the time for you to be able to get the answer to the dream and the visions. God is saying that now is the time, hallelujah, to come to the throne room. This is an urgent call to the throne room. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. So People of God, I just pray that you take heed to this message. I pray that you will obey God and you will listen to what he's saying. Um, God is asking you to come to, into prayer. Um, ask him what your orders are going to be. Ask him when you're going to fail. God needs your undivided attention. He is calling the people to the throne. God has some stuff that he wants to speak to the body of Christ about. And I pray, Lord God, that you all will have a blessed day. Remember, we are here on purpose to glorify God in Jesus' holy name. And I I just love, love, love you guys. I want you to be blessed, okay? Bye.